Does anyone else have this problem where their sleeves just won't roll at the same length? I guess I'm just not a proper gay. The secret to happiness is finding something you love and then doing that for the rest of your life. Hey guys, Move Maker Rachel or Bridget, that's my real name, and today I'm going to be showing you guys the 10 different types of lesbians during the quarantine. Let's go. The fucking gay. They feed off of impulse and don't make the most rational choices, but they pick their poison wisely. So if they're coming out for the first time during this quarantine period, they're probably going to slit their own eyebrow. But if they've been out for a while, they'll probably turn to shaving their own head, giving themselves a septum piercing or a nose piercing, or my favorite, giving themselves stick and poke tattoos. The wine gay. This girl might have not been a partier before the quarantine, but she'll definitely be a partier after the quarantine. Drinks up, ladies. And it is 2 p.m. on a Monday. Thank you. She'll either stalk her ex-girlfriend's Instagram. Fuck, she got hotter. Or worse, text her ex. She might just start drunk calling random people from her contacts list. Hey, I know we haven't like talked in like five years, but like, okay, <laughs> you got me. Uh, uh, I'm a little wasted. Uh, just a little, just a little bit. But I wanted to call and like say, you know, I'm just talking to you, okay? Like really, I, I mean it, okay? Okay, bye. Or telling her crush she likes them. The problem is, she may forget her actions by the next morning. Number three, the TikTok gay. Let's dive deep into the deep dark world of TikTok lesbians. The fuck girl. Honestly, I don't know who the fuck to trust. This is my friend or my fault. I must have exit the draw. Yeah, she gave me that claim as well. I remember back when I was younger, I was happy. The femme girl. I can fall in love with you. The quarantine girlfriend. They're probably freshly single and just joined Tinder or re-downloaded it, and they're extremely bored and need a girlfriend now. Zoom dinner dates. Hello? I, I can't hear you. I, I think your your audio is not on. You need to turn it up a bit. Can you hear me now? Oh, there you go. Hey, nice to meet you. I'm Annabelle. Sorry, I'm running a little bit late. Is I'm this thing on? The perfect date outfit. I hope this is not too much. Oh, it's no worries, man. Like, you look really nice. I see you dressed up. I like it. So tell me about yourself. You know, man, there's not much to say about me. Like, I, I go out and party on the weekends. I have friends. I smoke a lot of weed, you know, like, I have other goals in life other than my job, which is like a cemetery manager. But like, you know, we've been really busy right now and that's that's really good. Uh, Dad, yeah? Yeah, okay, I'm oh, coming. Oh, Hold you up. gotta go? Okay, I'm so sorry, Wait, but like my dad, dad really needs me to help him with this thing outside. You even so have a dad? I have to go, but it was so nice to meet are, are you. you lying have to a me? good night, bye. Do you not even have a dad? They spend way too much time on dating apps searching for their soulmate where they could have been writing the next best-selling romance novel. She's cute. My ex got ugly. Wait, what? It's 1 a.m.? The real question is, will their new lover and them meet after this quarantine? Or is it just a fling? Find out on the next episode. The Lonely Gay. They probably live alone or with a cat or multiple cats. They watch a ton of LGBT plus romance films, dreaming of falling in love after this quarantine, but then realize, oh, why do they always have to break up? Why can't the lesbians just be happy for once? They might have just got broken up with and now cry themselves to sleep, missing their ex and reminiscing about their past memories with them. This pillow will never be her. Number six, the chef gay. They barely knew how to make pasta before the quarantine, but now they can make creme brulee like that. Bonjour, je m'appelle Brigitte. Today, I will be showing you guys
knows how to make a very fancy French snack, le popcorn. Voila, it is that simple, just like that. They've become a professional chef, making cuisines from all over the world, decorating their food with their special touch, and posting all of their dishes on social media to show their crush they could cook. The back in the closet gay. Unfortunately, not all parents are supportive of their children being queer, so they may have to return back to the closet. Know you are not alone, and this is a serious issue. Here are some resources that could help you. QChat is a bully-free open space for LGBT plus youth to chat with trained staff from LGBT plus centers around the world and fellow LGBT plus teens. The Trevor Project has a lot of resources like a crisis intervention and suicide prevention phone service. To find out more, click the link in the description. The Workout Gay. They're not saying goodbye to that summer bod. Activities may include doing 100 push-ups, or in reality, 20. Zumba YouTube videos or yoga. Wait, what is the name of this? I thought this was yoga. Ooh. And don't forget to take those post-workout selfies. All the ladies will go crazy. The spiritual gay. They're using this time to self-reflect and dive deeper into themselves. They may turn to meditation. questioning and panicking about every single thing. Fuck. Oh. My. Gosh. Why does it have to come down to this? Oh my gosh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. How am I gonna get toilet paper? Aren't they sold out online? Aren't they sold out at the stores? What am I gonna do? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What am I gonna do? What if this is the start of an apocalypse? Oh my gosh, I don't have enough food. How is this gonna help me defeat zombies? What am I gonna do if they cancel Lala? And then Ride Fest? And then Christmas? Oh my gosh, I can't find a girl for cupping season then? 2020 is canceled! Hope this video made you guys laugh and you're staying safe during this quarantine. I wanna know what kind of lesbian are you? Do you fit any of these? Comment it below. And don't forget to subscribe if you like this content. Love you guys, bye! The secret to happiness is finding something you love and then doing that for the rest of your life. Does anyone else have this problem where like their sleeves just, oh, that is a huge bumblebee. Holy cow.